So I finally played Near Automata on Nintendo Switch. All right, okay, I'm not doing the Mr. Beast. The next big game out right now is not simply an enhanced HD port of a hero shooter or a story game with linearity that comes out as a retired HBO Max special. It's not just a video game. Matter of fact, it's no longer a game. It transcends video games. It's bigger than the multiverse. And I ain't talking about this one either. Today, we talk about the holy grail of Square Enix. One of the best of Square Enix within the last decade. Near Automata or Automata, whichever you want to see. <laughs> but for the Nintendo Switch. Now, I've played this game on PS4, the year it was released, and I will say the story is master clad. I won't spoil the story in the video because I believe if you're interested after this video, which I guarantee you most likely will be once I'm done, you will fall in love and will want to try the story. Let me get these out the way, I will answer these questions so fast. No, you don't need other near knowledge to play this game. You can play it on its own entity. You should start with Nier Automata, it is technically the sequel to Nier Replicant, but it builds upon the original game in every way. Also, the game is confirmed to be 30 FPS on Switch. Yes, it's not 60 FPS you nerds, but from my gameplay, the game runs totally smooth as I played the first three hours of Nier on Switch Dock. Speaking of that, let's talk about the handheld version and why I think it is the best version of the game out there, or at least one of the higher tier versions. The PC version of Nier Automata is broken or was for a long period of time. It's missing a lot of graphics options and customization options that a PC port should have. It took them pretty much four to five years to patch Nier on PC and I still don't think it's 100%. I am a simple man. I am not a man who asks for much. And the fact that this is portable is all I really can ask for. Sometimes, personally, I will trade high-end graphics and optimization for portability and accessibility. That's why I love the Switch and will eventually get a Steam Deck in the future to potentially get the best of both worlds. I know there's a Steam Deck that is mostly better than the Switch overall in performance and specs, but for near case, you have to mod the game to get it to work properly on Steam. Yeah, you have to use a mod like Special K or FAR to get the game up to par, and I don't want to go into too much detail with that. I think the most impressive thing about Nier on Switch was the frame rate. Now, I was expected to be super inconsistent and ugly like The Witcher 3 on Nintendo Switch. I'm not talk about the frame rate, just talk about how that game looks on Switch. I think they nailed the resolution for Nier Automata, resolution for handheld, and here's the crazy thing. So Nier Automata runs at 1080p 30fps on the Nintendo Switch, compared to 900p at 60fps on the PS4. Yes, you lose a higher frame rate, but you get a higher resolution on the Switch. Obviously, through my playthrough of Nier Automata so far, you can see some of the textures and some things be kind of just smeared or smudged out. It's very, very rare, and you have to really be like, ugh, I see it. You know like in Final Fantasy 7 Remake when you play that game or when you played the PS4 version of it and you can see a lot of textures not pop in properly? You can see that here in some environments in Nier Automata. This is one of Square Enix's and Platinum Games best collaborations that we've ever had within that company. And I honestly think everybody should try this game and having the ability to play this portably is really good. I honestly think the Switch version is better than all the other versions accessibility wise because you have to go to this game so many different times or go through so many different routes to get the full story. And to be honest with you, being able to just pick up and play it instead of having to just sit up and focus makes this very easy or more lax to go through in my personal opinion in 2022 unless I don't know about the Steam Deck version. The Switch version is the way to go for me to play this game. At the end of the day, I am super excited for Nier Automata on the Nintendo Switch. This is really fun. I'm happy and I hope Square Enix puts more energy and supports like this in the future. This kind of tilts me that I don't even think it's just a Square Enix thing or probably that division just didn't want to do the work, but they can literally port Kingdom Hearts 1 and 2 and 3 on Switch. I do not believe that at this point. They can put them games on Switch. This is like a God's plan port. Like somebody was out there in Square Enix was like, no, we're going to make this happen. And they made it happen. And this makes me even more excited for the end of the month because Bayonetta 3 finally drops at the end of October. And I am so excited for this, seeing Platinum Games back again with the fire. So if you guys are interested in Nier Automata for Nintendo Switch, I highly recommend this title, like highly. Out of any review, 
This is probably like top five most praised that's going to be about you. <laughs> and Square Enix, please port the Kingdom Hearts games properly on Switch. You could do a next anniversary. Just tell us it's coming, man. I just want Cage 2 portably. But again, thank you Square Enix for sponsoring today's video and providing the code for Nier Automata on Nintendo Switch. The end of your high edition. If you guys would like to see more content about fighting games, JRPGs, and reviews, please hit the subscribe button. And also, like the video, it helps your boy out, and leave a comment on your thoughts on how I did. That being said, it's your boy Avatar Yaya. Follow me on Twitter at Avatar Yaya underscore. Go ahead and do that. And remember, you guys are golden, and that is raw. Squala, peace, and I'm out. I've been a devil, I need me a hawk in the heart of my breathing, I feel well like time's raw Walking this bitch with a sound box, I wanna see rock it, I keep me a domino Bitch, I'm a dip and I feel like a Zaki, stretching that pussy out like it's Pilates I'm dashing the soul, I fight out of a body, fire, I'm spitting, I feel well like Dobby White bitch, blonde hair, looking like Lucy, she from Kiyoshi, I paint her face suki